Warning! Structural integrity failing. Emergency resuscitation of all personnel initiated. Exit this facility and report to production terminal Lima. Hello everybody, Helsinki here. Your medical status is diagnostic failure. Report to medical officer for unknown. Hmm. I'm in diagnostic failure. Welcome to Tectonia. I'm um, sorry. Tectonica. Tectonica. Look at here. This is some places that we can't get to, obviously. Window in front of us. I can't get in there. We do get a few things here. Let's grab what we can. Grab our first item here. And let's make our way out. I'm not sure uh, what happened if we were asleep for a long time or, or what, but I guess we have no memory of, of anything. Locked inside a, a shelter for all my, all my time. Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? Your suit can't transmit a voice or ID signal, but my sensors oh. are indicating you're out there. I'm here. First things first, check in at that production terminal. I need a second set of eyes on how badly damaged it is. Alright. So we are beginning our journey. We're going to gather, gather, gather as much of this biomass as we can get. This is a very addicting game. Uh, I played a few minutes to get the feel for it. And it looks like it's kind of like satisfactory. Uh, but with a, a sort of like a, I don't know, a story to it. I've heard some comments, you know, on Steam uh, say that it's like a combination of Satisfactory and like Subnautica. I don't know that part yet, but I just know it's, uh, it's, you're going to be building a lot, making factories and mining resources. Let's, let's go on with our quest. Inspect. Supply and repair the production terminal with 15 iron ore and 15 copper ore. Build and place a mining drill a nearby iron vein or copper vein. So. This terminal is cooked. Mining drills were the only buildable tech I could recover. Try crafting a few with materials from some of the chests around here. Okay, I'll get right to it. So, we need to craft these mining drills. I'm gonna craft, I can, right now I can currently make four, so that's what I will make. I think I'm gonna put them on number one in our alternate on our alternate uh, tool belt. So pressing F1, I can do such a thing like this. And I'm just gonna put Task one for now. Mining drill. Must be built at an ore vein and fueled with plant matter. And we do have some plant matter. We are gonna get started and look at her go. Now over here is some copper. I originally thought uh, this wall was copper, but I can see, plainly see now, this is the copper. Let's 
this, grab a few more pieces. And I'm gonna put... Copper. I just want everything nice and flat. I'm gonna put the copper. Hey, copper. I'll put you out here. No, I can't. You're not copper. I gotta put you out here. There we go. Now. Shift click. And I'll put a few more materials while I head back onto the other side. We should have, we should have our required amount by the time I get there. And yes, I do. And we should have close to that mount in a few minutes. Over here, let's grab some more stuffs. Grab all we can. Because we're never going to have enough of this stuff. I can, I can guarantee that. Just the way that the playthrough is started from the my first practice time. There we go. We get what we need there. Let's go back over here. Let's see what we can do. Let's put in 15, 15, and do repair terminal. New technology is available. Excellent. Good work getting that ore plugged into the terminal, Groundbreaker. Why, thank you. If you weren't on my crew, you should have been. For the next phase of repairs, you're gonna need a scanner. Mm. The tech for it unlocked automatically when you fix this thing. So, open up your crafting menu and build one. Okay. So now let's go to our... Uh, equipment. And here is our... Scanner. I'm crafting one scanner. Task inbound. Scanner. Scan machine fragments to restore tech tree access. Okay. So now that we get, we need to collect 20 iron ingots, 20 copper ingots, build and place three mining drills to enable automated extraction of ore, scan three smelter fragments to restore the machine for activation in the tech tree. And this is, I think this is a smelter here, I think. That's one. And that's two. Yep, that's two. And hopefully this is three. That's three. So, now we got our smelter. If we go into our B location, we can tell our smelter is right here. Uh, and we got a little bit of a note. Committee members, attached. Please find my exhaustive. Okay, well, this is, okay, this is a girl. <clears throat> Committee members, attached. Please find my exhaustive report detailing all rationales for why the AN must reconsider their original plan to focus primarily on raw resources extraction in favor of developing an expedition that can achieve full industrialization. Refocusing our efforts on building refinement operations, smelters and assemblies and etc. directly within Calyx to send home furnished, home finished goods may seem exuberantly difficult and expensive, but anything less would be respectfully, disgracefully foolish. Popularity is not a concern. The numbers do not lie. Lieutenant Colonel Naomi Laurent, PhD. Okay. So that is fantastic. Let's scan this. We got some materials for this, and what is this thing? A one of three fast inserter fragments. Two of three fast inserter fragments. 
Okay, so now we can open our tech tree with T. Uh, we got a huge tree. Uh, several levels long. We got basic science. This is kind of confusing what this thing does, but I don't know. There's our smelter. We need eight of these to, to build a smelter. And that... Research cores required for activation of new technologies. Refer to tech tree for current core manifest. And that is over here, as you can see. So I'm just going to scan this. We'll make... We'll make uh, those things. I can only make five right now. So let's open up these boxes that she, somebody left for us. Uh, copper frames, electrical components, iron components, and copper components. In that box, this box has copper frames, electrical components, iron components, copper components, iron frames. And what is this thing here? Upgrade module scanned. Additional tech tiers or cores may be required. Open tech tree to review. So it looks like we'll be able to, um, where would that be? Transportation, I believe. Tech suit. Suit, suit speed two is part of what we learned there. Uh, I guess it didn't fully unlock it. Your mining drills won't be able to get you everything you need to build the rest of those research cores. Situations like these are why we always left chests with backup components kicking around. Thank you very much. I'll need some of those backup components. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and get this. Iron components, copper components. Okay. The usual. Let's see if I can find anything different that I'll let you know. Nothing different. And what is this? Nope, nothing different. <clears throat> okay. Now I wonder if I can get rid of these things now. No, I can't get rid of those things. But we should be able to make more of these things. I think I'll just make uh, another five. If I right click, I should get another five. Actually, I need more because I think I need eight. Now, how these work, I don't know. It's, it's kind of strange, but what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna start stack them on top of each other. So four, put two here. And then I can jump up here. Yeah, I'm just gonna Research make Research course constructed. Smelter technology available for activation in tech tree. Basically, I'm just gonna make a stair stay away up here. I can't won't let me add any more I think there's stuff in our way. So let me clear some of it out with my handy dandy pickaxe. get rid of this stuff. I just want it as high, as high and out of the way as possible. It's kind of silly in a way, but, I'm, but like I said, I'm not sure what it's used for, so we don't, I don't, at least I don't know. I, I'm thinking it's silly right now to do something like that, but who knows? It might have a purpose. Let me sit this on top. Thank you. And I got two more. I'm gonna go ahead and do that and walk you down. Okay, so we are out. You uh, need to activate recipes in the tech tree before you can craft them. 
Try doing that now with the smelter. Okay, so I need to activate. <clears throat> I should be under equipment. No. Uh... Oh, I gotta, I gotta learn it first. All right, smelters. Now I got eight healed up, and uh, I'll have a couple left over. Three left over, so now I can. Technology activated. Proceed with construction of smelter. So now, am I stuck? Now I can make a smelter. And actually, I'm also going to also make. Another drill. <clears throat> now let's make my smelter. I'm gonna make two, one for the iron, one for the copper. And we'll, and we'll probably end up making uh, more of them later. So I'm gonna press F2. I'm gonna kind of put this in the center. Press my R to rotate. There. Task inbound. Smelter. Supply with ore to produce ingots. Requires plant matter for fuel. Absolutely, it does. I wouldn't have it any other way. Uh, intermediates. Uh, let's see. Base building. Okay, so uh, currently. I can only take from here and add it to it. Now, where is my. There you go. Let's run over here and do the same thing for the copper. Hey, Gabo. Okay, I gotta get that out of the way. Don't like it. Um, also let me scan this thing too, so I can get rid of it. This is going to give me... This. Okay, so now I can make a fast inserter. We'll get rid of this thing too. Um, lights. I'm going to go ahead and put that on the zero. I'm not sure if I'll be needing those too much. I got a bunch of bioluminescence stuff here, so... F1, we're gonna make another mining drill. Put you right here. Thank you. That can be, yeah, should be roughly in the same line as that one. And now let's make a smelter. F2. And let's pull that. Far enough out. There we go. Goodness gracious, we got a smelter, folks. Let's go ahead and put some of you in there. Now we don't have a lot of we don't have a a lot of uh, biomass, so I really can't fill up this machine. So let's just. Pick up a few more things. I'm not sure what the uh, this limestone is is used for yet, if anything. But I've been picking it up as I as I've gone. Scan, and then we'll scan this. It does give us cool stories about this stuff. Okay, so we got the fast extractor, the mining drill, the creeping hydra. <clears throat> and the light stick. Let me pick it. Let me pick it up. Creeping hydra. It's all over the place. And I thought about uh, doing a 
I can role play with this game. But I didn't see it. Uh, I didn't know if it was going to be too entertaining or not, so I just stopped what I was doing and just. I was kind of practicing, anyways. But, um. What was I saying? Oh, I was kind of. Oh! Oh my gosh. Yeah, I was kind of practicing and I said, well, I don't know if I like, like how it's going. And I don't think you guys would understand what I was doing. So I said, well, let me not, let me not do that. But if you just, if you think you want something like that, I probably will play this game a whole heck of a lot uh, in several different ways, or at least several different times. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Maybe, uh, if I, maybe I can do it that, that way. Where it's more of a role play style thing. And we'll scan this thing here in a second. Because we're not going to ever have enough bioluminescence, uh, biomass, or whatever this stuff is. Because I would like to, like, because I was thinking about what I was doing, what I was trying to do was basically read all these little notes on all these things like if I scan this there's a story to it and it's usually somebody you know saying what happened and I was going to try to do it portray it in their voices and things like that but then I said well no it's getting too bogged down and I don't think anybody would have really enjoy it too much but I was enjoying it anyways computer has a requisition for local plant life to be delivered to a science team for analysis. It looks like the request was approved, but hmm. doing it was marked as a low priority by command, even though the request itself was marked as urgent. We didn't come here for science, but I don't remember this kind of hostility about it either. Me what neither. Are doing here? I don't remember anything. I remember nothing. Okay, so yeah, we're doing pretty good about collecting all this stuff. Let me get some more of this limestone. <clears throat> There's a bunch of little secrets. <laughs> And hidden things in this game. One, I, I I don't think most people will will know about for sure. I just happened to watch it on uh, somebody's YouTube channel, and we're gonna do that too once we get there. Just add some. Oh yeah, we got we got a nice decent amount now. Let's grab all we can here. Let's. Uh, let's throw in some more. Let's take what we got here. We should have what we should have what we need now for our level two of this thing. Let me take out what we got here. Take this out and put it in here. Excellent. So we have what we need. Over here. And this is we need 20 copper and 20 iron. Shift click, shift click. Upgrade terminal. New technologies available. Terminal upgraded. New technology and crafting schematics available. Okay, so now. We gotta supply and maximize the production terminal by depositing two containers, four inserters, 30 iron ingots, 30 copper ingots, and 45 conveyor belts. So we can pretty much make that. There we go. So if I... Right click 5, 10, 15, 20. 
Oh, we can only get... Oh, boy. What, what do we need now? I think... I might have just goofed up, y'all. But nah, not really. We can get more stuffs. It's all over the place. Let me put more stuff over here. While that stuff is making or being made. Super fun. Okay. Well. I move the crates, uh, crates to three, these things to four, maybe down some more, and you guys to five. So then, now, oops, F4. Probably come on the inner side first. Do one of these. Task inbound. Inserter. Use inserters to transfer items between machines and conveyor belts. Yes, I'm gonna do inserters. <clears throat> now. F5. Let's, let's try to make sure it's going the correct way. Okay. I think I'm going to get rid of this line here. Let's go back to it. F5 F5 and we will rotate it the rotate tool and then we'll need our F4 what the heck happened there there uh, F F4 and then we know that F4 so Uh... 